According to tradition, Saint Valentine was a 3rd century Christian priest who was executed by Emperor Claudius the Cruel for marrying young lovers in violation of Claudius' decree against marriage. Somehow, Western culture has turned this strange story into the ultimate greeting card holiday full of chocolates, flowers, low commitment hookups and insincere romantic promises. Our version of Valentine's Day provides a glimpse into our broader view of sex, love and marriage. It is full of fine-sounding promises and romance, but often lacks deeper meaning and genuine commitment. Most of us still believe in and hope for committed love, but many of us have no idea how to develop healthy, long-term, loving relationships. Here are some strategies for developing healthier ones first. Make sex more special and valuable by making sexual relationships rarer. This strategy may be counterintuitive, but it is well known that the scarcer the supply of anything, the more valuable it becomes, and the more people will sacrifice for it. Opinions in your inbox, get a digest of our takes on current events everyday sexual relationships used to be rarer and more difficult to obtain prior to the 1960s. That scarcity made those relationships more special, meaningful, valuable and unique. This view actually treated sex as more valuable than our culture's current view. Sex, and our sexual partners, are too valuable to treat in a casual, uncommitted way. Instead, our culture has flooded the dating marketplace with easily attainable, low-quality, low-commitment sex. Unsurprisingly, the value of sex and sexual relationships has dropped substantially. It is no longer as special. Sex has become mundane and our partners easily replaceable.